Right, so what's up guys? Welcome to the video. Today I'm at our buzzing once again. Literally, the videos recently, every single one of them, I've just, oh, I can't wait to pick the camera up. I feel like I've not put this camera down uh, for the past week, which I'm happy with. I love it. I enjoy it. What is that on the screen there? Oh, it's glare from the... Is it? There we go. We're all good. But today is a horrible day. It's absolutely awful. Uh, like, let me just show you. Look at that. For any people that watch my videos that might live in America, this, welcome to England. Welcome to England. I uh, hope you enjoy your stay. Uh, I'd, I'd leave as soon as you can. Yeah, so today we're fitting the coilovers to the EP3. Now, ooh, I've been waiting so long. Literally, I've, I, I just want the car to be lower and I want it to handle better. I mean, the handling on EP3s, if you do know, is pretty decent. I mean, Hondas are known for having good handling. It is a really good handling car, but why not make it even better? Yellow speed call over is going on today. I cannot wait. We had the exhaust done yesterday, which, oh, look at that bad boy. Four inch tip. I absolutely love it. It sounds amazing. But yeah, as you know, obviously the back of my car is stripped out. So there's nothing in the back and it's really, really high on the back arches. So that's all changing today. But what we're doing, we're not doing it on the driveway. We're not doing it in the garage. We're not doing it in the unit. We're actually going to Phil's house. Uh, now, Phil, he's met, I think he's been in a couple of other videos. Uh, he's got a white FK2 with like a carbon bonnet, carbon boot. Uh, we're doing a video on his car actually this Tuesday. We're going to TDI Northern. He's getting some work done on his. And he's invited me down to go film it, which 100% I want to go. Uh, so yeah, that's what the plan. We're going to pick Adam up, then we're heading to Phil's. He's got a big massive garage. It's absolutely amazing at his house. Um, but yeah, first things first, I need to go ahead and take my old M2 system out the boot uh, and then load up a few tools. But I just want to say this M2 system uh, is for sale. If anyone wants to buy it, then just let me know because uh, I'm open to offers. Let me know how much uh, you've got to spend kind of thing. Uh, so yeah, just shoot me some offers on Instagram or something and we'll probably be able to sort something out. Anyway, I'm going to get this out of my boot, get my tools, shut up rambling and get on the road. Oh my Lord, it's disgusting out there. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take the boys some moose juice to share the love because it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, I'm going to take everyone some green apple. Now if you're wondering where to get moose juice from, um, B&M Bargains sell moose juice and there's a couple of other like petrol stations, I think BP might sell it. Um, just have a look around but the most common one you see them in all the time is BP. My personal favourite is the green apple but the others are really nice and refreshing. Absolute legends, moose juice. I won't promote them if I didn't drink them. Grab yourself one. All right, anyway, let's hit the road, throw these in the boot. Let's go get these coilovers on. I almost forgot one thing we need to do first, which you haven't heard yet, is a cold start with the new exhaust. <laughs> so in the end, we decided so we decided to put the anti-roll bar uh, in the boot, camber arms as well, because we might as well do them all while we're here and then leave the rest as in the ball joints and uh, steering arms for uh, for motion to do on the 21st. Just thought the more I can get them with self, the less uh, the less he has to do and the less money it costs in the end. But yeah, anyway, uh, we're at Adam's now, just picking Adam up. Then we're going to go to Phil's. I think Dino's going as well with the uh, turbo Integra. Main thing today is just getting these coilovers on, making sure everything's bolted up properly no bodging no though that'll be all right get them done properly if they're not going in properly we're stopping at that and we're going to find like the solution i don't want to anything on this car i don't want to bodge um i wanted to get it done properly i mean i would give it a go myself putting these coilovers on but i'm not experienced and i'm not confident in doing it so i'm not going to bother um i'm just going to do it with my mates who've done it before phil's had like three ep3s i think or two ep3s he brought his off the forecourt and stuff like that he's had a, he's been around hondas for a long time so he's a good guy to um to be able to help me out today his garage is big as well so uh, that shouldn't be a problem should be should be a good time another one of them videos where uh, we're just gonna get shit done with the boys and uh yeah right adam's here now uh let's hit the road your boy's got that j3 merch on you know <laughs> not for reckon sorry but i just i just have to film this like so this is phil's car you've probably seen it on the channel before like dream garage and that you come in Oh, he's just got the same car sat here on Forza. <laughs> That's so sick. So this was Phil's EP3 and all the trophies he won with it. What a guy. 
give it a go. Yeah, for See what he thinks. That's my favourite flavour. Look at these. They're so chodish. <laughs> oh, they're a lovely bit of kit. Yeah, they're such a nice bit of kit, man. It's a shame they're going to get all dirty, but we've got the wheels off. I've never done anything like this before, ever. Never touched suspension on my cars, never done lowering springs, nothing like that. It's only a finger bump, but come out on this, isn't it? I've been told it's really easy on these. Did you do yours yourself, Phil? I did. Oh, did you? Oh, there we go. So we've, uh, we've someone that knows. Now, these have got eye back lowering springs on it, so I'm crossing my fingers that all the bolts aren't absolutely uh, like seized on there, because obviously they've been off at some point to put the springs on. So... See if we're going to go one of two ways with me, it'll either be... Has it? Sweet, it's been looked after. It's, good. it's always goes one of two ways with me. It's either car stays here for tonight and I get a taxi home, <laughs> or it goes really smooth. <laughs> so, we'll find out. But yeah, I'm going to uh, kind of take these boys' advice, because Adam, Chief, needs to, seems to know what he's doing here. Chief talk shitter. Chief shit talker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this side, I think uh, they're just going to kind of run me through the basics of what to do. I'm going to watch and learn a bit, and then obviously the other side, I'll, uh, I'll do more bits myself. But Phil's already cracking on here, pretty much done now. <laughs> and uh, I'm just doing this one now. Should, should be a, uh, a simple process. Dave at Motion said it was simple as well. Um, Some it seems to be working. <laughs> How's it going, Shag? Not hand. I need to give a massive shout out to Iron Hell again because, like, this is the most handy thing I've ever had in my life. Oh, is that a uh, turboed Integra I've heard? Yeah, it is. <laughs> We're doing a review on this, do you know? Yes. Hey, man, like Toby. Oh, I like Bonnet as well. <laughs> Gorgeous. Very, very nice. Oh, here we go. Here we go. VXR, that? Mate, it's sick, isn't it? Is that right? Does it it's alright. Why is it everyone that's got a sick car just says it's alright? <laughs> Stay tuned because this is one of the 9K sponsor cars, so we're going to be doing a review on this very, very shortly. Absolute weapon, man. Look at it. <laughs> you got her? She's here, look. Whoa! Jesus, it's massive. Yeah, they're stupidly big, aren't they? Thumbnail. For sale, I back Lauren Spring for an EP3. You can... uh, Look at us reading the instruction manual. Okay. As well, I'll do a job proper once, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> Look at those. Yeah, let me get this camera arm off. Look how well they match the control arms, boys. <laughs> Looks sick, then. Buzzing. Just uh, undoing the old camber arm now to uh, to put the new ones on. We might, we're just going to bolt everything up. It probably won't drive as well as it should, but we're just going to put everything on just so it makes Dave's job easier. Uh, we're not going to adjust the settings or anything. Literally just put it on, ready for the 21st to uh, get the fast road set up. So that's kind of the plan. How's front going all right? It's on. I'm going to give the other side a go. But yeah, just getting this camber arm off and then that's literally this side of the car's done. Let's have a look at what it looks like in here. So there's before, there's after. <laughs> it's the little things. Oh my God. Are you sure these aren't gonna rub, Phil? Well, yeah, then again, the coil over, so they shouldn't give give way as much but oh sugar yeah i do realize as well once we've put it all on um that with the camber arms we're just setting them to the exact same as the ones that we just took off uh, it probably will drive like shit and probably snake all over the road or something but i'm going to put it in the garage and drive it as little as possible uh until the 21st when we're down at motion so yeah dave knows i'm doing all this so uh should be all right on the day oh yes after Ugh. I'm ready. Slowly. <laughs> We're going down. Mate, that fitment on the back. If it stays like that, then that's going to be ruthless. <gasps> oh, that's sexy. Oh, mate. <laughs> that's perfect, isn't it? Look at camber on back, it looks like a bloody stance car. 
mint. So let's just get a quick compare. Oh, that's flush, my fingers are flush. Yeah, we're good there, boys. We're good there. <laughs> so what are we doing here? Ah, lad, just taking these bolts off here. Go on. Take that. Take that. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go in, let's go in. Yeah, we're going then. Fucking <laughs> 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 oh. <laughs> yeah, hell, that was great. <laughs> so we're literally done, except this one bolt, which is being really, really stubborn uh, to get out. Then literally drop this one, set this all out, coil over in, and that's it, drop the car and adjust a few little bits. Um, like I said, we're not adjusting it loads, but um, just, just so it doesn't knacker the tires. But like I said, I'm not gonna really drive it much until the 21st. Um, and then we should be good after that. But it's quite literally just this last one. And uh, then we should be good. Fingers crossed the bolt doesn't snap. Fingers crossed it comes out, but we'll have to see. Everything so far has gone really smooth, hasn't it boys? It's gone really smooth, so. Hopefully we'll just get a bit of brute force on this and uh, it'll be good. It's getting dark outside already. Hey, James at Waxing Away, if you're watching this lad. Jesus, look at that. That's, <laughs> that's actually insane. Boys and girls, we're all tight now. I know the camera's actually absolutely ridiculous on that side, but that's, that's your boy fucking that up. Um, we're just going to give it a do here. I need some fist bumps, boys. I need some fist bumps. Phil, these are me boys. <laughs> Look at this now, it's proper. <laughs> Buzzing. First time I've ever had coilovers on a car as well. All my other cars, the XR, SRI, not that I can really count that, but they've all been uh, lowering springs, so I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, I just want to say thank you as well to all the boys here, James, Phil and Adam. I'll put all the links in the description. If you do want to do me a favour and you're not a patron or something, just go drop me mates a follow. And as stupid as it sounds, just say thank you for helping me out because I appreciate it so much. We're going to take it for a spin and uh, and see what it's like. A little bit of adjusting to do, just a, just a little uh, minor thing so it's not ruining the tyres majorly and pulling and that. But this is the worst bit now. It's only going to get better. And look at that fitment, man. Oh... Gorgeous. Yeah, so just quick, so far it feels really good. It's a lot more responsive now in the steering, like you're turning it actually is quite instant. Um, I, I explained it, there's no lag in the steering. Obviously we need to sort the camera out on that side. Uh, the front seems really good. Uh, we need to sort the camera. Let me just, <sighs> Honda Life. And um, yeah, we're just gonna grab some food before we carry on because we're a little bit hungry. We've been at this for a few hours now. So pick the camera up when we get back. Coming to an end. Sorted out Cambro. <laughs> it's not fucking camera. It's not frickin'. Ain't no plans. Sorting out Cambro and stuff. Then we've encountered another problem. Young whippersnapper. This dickhead here <laughs> has lost his train. Mum's going mental. Mum's absolutely got to do arse And he's done a boo boo. <laughs> but we've got. We've had Jesse working in his own car tonight. I know, it's been a right eventful night, hasn't it? Some uh, sight for sore eyes, you yeah. might be able to call it. Is Not it? encountered any problems because of this. What, well, that, this? This. This, this bad year. This. <sighs> the car handles amazingly now, and it's not even got its track set up. Oh. It absolutely flies around corners. It's three o'clock in the morning, man. Obviously, the trains got cancelled for James. Um, so I had to literally drive all the way to Blackpool to take him home. I couldn't just leave him to sort his own shit. Um, drive all the way to Blackpool, dropped him off, and obviously drop Adam off. And I've just got home now, three o'clock in the morning. I'm absolutely knackered, but the car's amazing. The car handles brilliantly. It's hard for me to get excited because I'm really, really tired, but it looks amazing, handles amazing. I couldn't be happy with it, but... Oh man, look how good she sits now, man. Amazing. But I'm going to end this video here, boys. Sorry to end on a little bit of a downer. I'm just really, really tired. Uh, but yeah, if you did enjoy this video, we finally got coilovers on the evening 3. Stay tuned because on the 21st, we're at Motion Motorsport. I mentioned that about seven times. If you did enjoy the video, please remember to like, comment and subscribe. I love you all, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.